Hey lover, new year, new finds at Dollar Tree. Come shop with me and see what new hygiene and makeup products are worth our dollar twenty-five. Come on. The makeup section is looking nice and healthy. Let's see what they're offering. So in my last Dollar Tree shop with me in the Plainfield store, they had this makeup banishing towel and I did pick one up. So let me give you a quick review. Y'all, this is worth $1.25. It is the size of a regular size washcloth, so nothing oversized, um, but it does help get your makeup off. Compare it with a cleanser that they're offering here. And now look, they have this makeup remover towel by a different brand. So this one looks like it's like a mint. So you can stick your hand in here and they have a lot of colors. They have black, lavender, um, cream baby blue we may pick one of these up to see and compare it to my vanishing towel as well as I have another makeup removing towel that I use as well so let's pick up one of these in lavender all right they have a lot of new lip products so let's get into these um, last time I was at this store I did pick up this oh uh, I did pick up one of these Levlon lip colors this is the shade that I ended up picking up in this Revlon lip color, y'all. And it is giving like a nudie pink, but more so pink than nude. But I do like it. I like the formula. I like how it feels on my lips. I like how it looks. It's more on the glossy side than matte. So if you are into your glossy colors, this is definitely something you want to try. So far, I've only seen two colors. I've only seen this color and then this ready mauve pink color. I picked up this one. All right, here are two different kind of lip glosses that, that claim to have hydrolonic acid in it of the company B Color. So let's see, we have two flavors. We have Fire Quartz and Garnet. I really like these colors. I think I like Fire Quartz better. I like more of a, a peachy pink kind of color, more so than just straight up pink. So I think we're gonna pick up the Fire Quartz. I found a freckle pin. I'm seeing that faux freckles are still very popular. I'm one of those people since I already have freckles. I like to cover my freckles, but if you want to join the freckle gang, stop by your local Dollar Tree and see if they have this freckle pin. So this one I'm holding my hand is in the shade light brown. So that leads me to believe that they might have it in other shades, but in this location, they only have the light brown. And I've also found some cuticle oil in two different flavors. They have mango as well as lavender. And y'all, if you're new to me, I love everything lavender because- So good, it is so good. I love this color and the smell. I think we're gonna pick this up to test this out. So let's see what this said we should use this for. So this is supposed to help strengthen and maintain healthy nails and cuticles. And as you can see, I'm on my regular nail journey. I used to do acrylic tips like a long time ago, but I kept breaking them. So I just went back to my regular nails. And right now I'm going through, uh, I don't know what I'm going through with my nails, but they keep breaking off. So let's pick up this cuticle oil pen to see if it helps me out any. If you're new over here, this is a LA Color Stand channel as well as a Freeman Stand channel. I love that stuff, you know. Um, LA Colors has this new gloss. It is a plump lip gloss that says it's going to instantly plump your lips with a tingling sensation. It seems they have three different shades. They have Careless, Surge, and Call Me. And y'all, I'm leaning towards Surge because I really like like neutral tones and pinks. So I think we're gonna pick up the Surge color in this and test it out. I have found some concealers by LA Colors. I have been wanting to test out LA Colors concealers. The concealer that I currently use is by LA Girl. And I've always been curious about some, about LA Colors concealers. So they have several to pick from. They have a yellow, they have a highlighter shade, they have lavender that says it's going to help with shallowness. They have yell the yellow says it's going to help with dullness. Then they have green. Green is supposed to help with redness. Since I love highlighter, I'm gonna give this one a try. So I have found a jelly highlighter by Rimmel London. Y'all remember when everyone was doing jelly everything? It's blasted all over the internet. Um, so they have it in this not so cute like neon pink color. So we're gonna pass on that because I'm not really feeling that color. Then I also found a bronzer from Rimmel London. This shade, it might work for me, but then again, I might a little be 
might be a little bit too light, so we're gonna pass on that as well. Let's Let's check out what is new in the beauty and skincare. They still have the mint lip sugar scrub with the matching scrubber, and y'all, I did pick this up, and I will say this is lovely. And I also wanna mention, this has removed enough dead skin cells that my natural lip color is even brighter. So if you are also, so if you also are dealing with some discolored lips, give this a try. It's going to cost you two dollars and fifty cents plus tax. So look, y'all, I'm noticing they have this mint lip oil. This is like a three-step process you can do. So you can do the lip scrub with your lip scrubber, and then after you scrub all that off, you can follow it up and top your lips with the lip oil. I didn't know about this. We need to pick this lip oil up. Back from Global Beauty, they have this is a multivitamin serum it has vitamins vitamin b c and e and niacinamide now if in one of my dollars you shop with me i was talking about these skin is it this well it's by it's by the same brand it's by global beauty care talking about how i didn't feel like their skin mask this is a skin cream but they also make a whole bunch of skin masks i was saying how i don't feel like the, the skin masks really do anything for us but that was because i was not checking the ingredients now i check the ingredients with everything so let's look at the ingredients on this vitamin c serum okay so this product is not going to be worth our dollar 25 because niacinamide if you can see is like fourth or fifth from the bottom so that means there is going to be a low amount of niacinamide in here so we don't need to spend our dollar 25 on this next they have this eye cream so i recently bought some of these products and this is by the same brand these are both by beauty global global beauty care and i'm noticing that the difference between this line of products and this line of products most of these come in the pretty silver packaging the ingredients are not the same the ingredients that you're going to find in these pretty packaging ones it has a higher concentration and better ingredients so if you're in dollar tree and you're trying to decide which skincare products to get don't get the ones in the pretty silver package get the ones that they have the pink or where's the green one oh or in this which green packaging since we're already here let's go ahead and look at the ingredients on this all right so i am seeing some collagen in this product and it's like the seventh or eighth ingredient down but there are some other ingredients in here that may be able to do something for our under eye so we may pick this up just to test it out but i still stand when it comes to these do not waste your dollar 25 if your dollar tree has this line or this line pick one of those up instead <laughs> product line looks new let's see it is comparable to Neutrogena Hydro Boost hand gel and cream now um, if you checked out my target shop with me I talked about that Hydro Boost body lotion that I've been seeing this YouTube other you other YouTube creator use that has beautiful skin her name is Simone Nicole I'm pretty sure I know at least it's Simone I'm gonna tag her channel so you can check her out she's a beautiful skin so this line is claiming to be similar to Neutrogena, so let's check it out. So they have three different products that they're offering in this line. They have a hand gel, hydrating facial wipes, and then this cutie, this is hydrating gel cream, I'm assuming for your face. It claims to have hyaluronic acid in it, so let's check out these ingredients. Unfortunately, y'all, there are no ingredients on this, but since this is the last one here, it's leading me to believe that this might be something we wanna pick up and try. So we're gonna go ahead and grab this. They have uh, added the complete line of that product that was claiming that you can compare it to the Olay Regenerous. And I was talking about that in reference to dealing with a lack of collagen in your skin, which is gonna, which is gonna be the reason why you have fine lines and wrinkles. And if you don't know, now you know, you know. So they have added the full line and we are definitely gonna try some of this. So they have, looks like three different products. They have a cream cleanser, a hydrating moisturizer as well as a fragrance free hydrating moisturizer and they're saying that this product is compared to compared to Olay Regenerous Micro Sculpting Cream. Let's check out the ingredients of these products. I think when I looked at this last time I did not look at the ingredients. All right so this product has some interesting ingredients in it. The main things that I'm seeing are glycerate, glycerin, 
sorbitol, salicylic acid, which is gonna be good for acne prone skin, and some lactic acid. So we may try this one instead. So let me see what's in there. All right, so this is the hydrated moisturizer. All right, so the second and third ingredient, this is mineral and glycerin. So that does lead me to believe that it's gonna have some hydration to it. So we're gonna go ahead and pick this up and try this out. They still have a variety of masks to pick from. And if you're curious on which one to pick, because there's so many options, they have a retinol, a charcoal, this essence mask, a glycolic acid, and a watermelon. I'm going to recommend that you pick between either the glycolic acid or the retinol, and the re or the retinol, preferably the glycolic acid. Um, I am a glycolic acid stand account over here. Um, I am so big on glycolic acid because it is a product that's going to help even tone your skin and help with your pores. This is a good gateway to get in to introduce yourself into glycolic acid for only $1.25. And then with the retinol, this mask is targeting towards age defying. So it's claiming it's going to help smooth appearance of fine lines. So you can do a combo of the retinol and the glycolic acid on your skincare day and see what your results are. And you do need to be doing your skincare twice a day every every day to see results. Now, here are these super cute products that I saw in the last Dollar Tree shot with me that I did in a different location when I did the shot with me in Plainfield. Over here, they have, it looks like the whole set. So they have the vanilla bean honey, the coconut mint lavender, and the watermelon mint. And let's see, and they're offering the body oil as well as the body butter. Let's see if we can smell this. I hate when they make all these cute products and then they seal them so you can't even smell them. Remember back in the day, they used to have the scratch and sniff where you were able to smell things. I found another new line that they're carrying. This is by the brand Be Pure and it is their essentially ageless skincare with collagen, niacin, my and vitamin E. Those are all the things that I love. It looks like they have three different products in this product line they have a collagen gentle cream cleanser a very heavy collagen nourish nourishing moisturizer and then they also have the collagen night moisturizer so you have a moisturizer for the day and a moisturizer for the night that is very nice so this product is claiming to reduce the appearance of wrinkles skin feels softer and more smooth will wake up with hydrated more radiant skin that sounds real nice let's look at these ingredients so unfortunately, collagen is literally the second to last ingredient. So y'all, this is not gonna be getting our dollar 25. Let's put this right back. All right, I found another face wash product and this would be something good to go with those makeup removing towels. And that's some great ingredients I already checked. So this is by the brand Skin Nutrition Botanicals. So this product is their tea tree oil and salicylic acid face balancing wash. And they also have these really cute jewel headed brushes. Um, I just grabbed the pink one, although you guys know I like to color coordinate over here. 